here from Southern Belle and as we all know, Valentine's Day is coming up in February along with my birthday which is the 20th and we're going to go ahead and be talking about that along with seeing if I can handle some sour knockout gummy hearts. y'all like I said we are gonna be talking about Valentine's Day Valentine's Day is coming up in the month of February it's gonna be here before we know it and you're gonna be buying a whole bunch of candy and a whole bunch of stuff for your loved ones or either your child which that's what I've done and I'm gonna go ahead and share that with y'all and also I'm going to see if I can handle because I don't really eat sour gummy stuff see if I can handle these sour gummy knockout hearts but first, if you did not know, my birthday is actually in February. It's February 20th. And I would absolutely love it if some of y'all would send me some birthday cards and make me feel good about myself. Because I'm a little bit conceited sometimes. But that would be so totally awesome. If you feel like you'd want to or you feel like you're up to it, you can send it to my P.O. Box. P.O. Box 558 Marble Falls, Texas 78654. Um, I would love to get, even if it's a drawing or a letter that said happy birthday or a birthday card, that'd be so cool and you would really be making my day, um, my whole month really, <laughs> if you all send me some birthday cards. And of course, I will warn you if I get enough birthday cards or a, a handful of birthday cards, I will do a video on it because I would just be flustered and be like, oh yeah, no. <laughs> so if you'd like to do that, you're more than welcome to. So, also, if you want to help support the channel, make sure you smack that like button show who's boss and hit that beautiful subscribe button if you are new I do all sorts of things from reviewing stuff to talking about things vlogs singing to video games all sorts of stuff so you won't want to miss it make sure you hit that bell not this bell get all the notifications so also if you want to help share the love share love with me by sharing this on your social media tag your friends tag your family I don't care who you tag just tag somebody let them know another bell videos out and since I appreciate each and every one of you for doing that here is a random Bell family comment of the video because I'm so thankful and I sound like Oprah. What the heck? But I'm so thankful for each and every one of you and just thanks. So the first things I'm going to show y'all is actually the things I got for my daughter. I'm not going to be eating those. It's not a whole lot or anything. Um, the first thing I got, she's in kindergarten. I don't know what they normally do for Valentine's Day, but I got all these little blow pop suckers. There's like 25, so that should be good enough for a class. And um, it has all these little bitty, uh, you know, instead of like the Valentine's card, you just put it on the sucker. So I was like, will this work? Is this a two for one? I hope this will work. Hopefully I don't have to buy any more than anything else. So I got this for Valentine's Day. I got it at the Walmart. It wasn't too much, I don't think. It says 25 pops plus cards. And they are cherry. Bubble gum. Oh, bubble gum filled. So they're cherry but filled with bubble gum. So I think my daughter will really like this. She hasn't seen any of this stuff though. And I also got her, just because I love her. Uh, she loves Frozen. Obviously not a sponsor. Frozen's not a sponsor. But she loves Frozen so I got these little bitty I know it's technically not Valentine's Day, although they, they're selling it for Valentine's, but this little, I guess, bouquet of suckers, uh, where there's Elsa, Anna, Olaf, and a purple heart, which the kind of what nightmares are made of, though. Oh, I'm sure she will love it, but oh my gosh, I don't know if y'all can see that well, but these are what nightmares are made of. Let me turn it for you so you can look. They're kind of creepy. Like, extreme. And I also have one more thing to show you before I get into trying the sour gummy thing to see if I can handle it. Because I don't eat sour gummies. And I might just first taste it to see if I even like it. And then shove a whole bunch in my mouth. So, we'll see. I have not planned this out yet. But I think it'll be entertaining. <laughs> the next thing I got for my, my beautiful, beautiful daughter uh, is this. My plan is to give her this. It has gummy hearts inside. My plan is to give her this and she'll be like, oh, thank you. But then she'll be like, oh, I wish it was mini. Oh, really? Is that really what you want, my sweet little angel? Well, guess what? Ba-bam! Ba-bam! And she loves these little things that go like this up and down. There's mini for you, sweetheart. Mommy done delivered. <laughs> 
I don't know. I thought it was cool. So <laughs> she likes mini, of course. So I'm gonna put it back on Mickey. So I know it's a whole moment away, but it's gonna be here before you know. So I'm gonna put it back, and when I give it to her, it's gonna be Mickey. I got it all thought out. That way I can amaze and surprise her. Be like, oh yay! Don't judge me. All right, let's get right into the sour gummy. So these are Trolley brands. These are the Sour Bright Knockout Hearts Berry Berry that I'm gonna be trying and seeing if I can handle and maybe stuffing some in my mouth. I don't know. I don't know if you can see that, but it's right there. But these are the Sour Knockout Hearts. Good look at that. Grab chow. And it's very berry, so I think it's blueberry and strawberries. At least that's what the little picture has. I don't know if you can see that, but that's what the little picture is. So it looks blue and pink, but I think because of the blue pink, it's a little purple. Which is cool because this is for. Mm, Valentine's Day. It's for Valentine's Day. Mm. Okay. And, you know. Woo! Woo. That, that is very berry. That is what berry is. Okay, and this is a disformed berry heart. But still, let me give me a good heart. Okay. I don't know if I have it. Oh, oh these are cute. Okay. So, let me go ahead and let you have a gander. Cute, they're little hearts. They got, you know, each one has a flip side. Pink and blue. They smell good. They smell like berries. I'm gonna go ahead and just taste one and see how this works out, okay? You ready? I'll let you know if I like the taste too. I may not be able to handle the sour, but I'll let you know if I'm, I'll let you know if I can handle the sour, if I can't handle the sour, and I'll let you know if the taste is good or not. So. It smells good though, like, it smells like I'd want to eat it. <laughs> but do I want to? Very chewy. Very, very, very chewy. It tastes good. It smells better than it tastes. Not that it tastes bad at all. It just smells better than it tastes. But at least for one of them, it's not bad on the sour radar. I don't know where the radar is, but for me, which I'm a big baby when it comes to hot stuff and sour stuff, like when I was younger, I used to, I don't know if you had like those packages of those big old, I guess they're sour straws. I used to eat those and like, well, I'd lick off the uh, sour part and then I'd eat it. And um, so when I was younger, I kind of liked it, but not anymore. I don't eat sour wear. Well, warheads. And uh, this is not bad. At least one of them isn't. But I think this might be hard though because they're very chewy. They're good. They're very chewy. It's not an overbearing sour. It's just like it's enough sour just to be good. You know, the good kind of sour where you're like, I want a little bit of a little bit of kick, but not a lot. This is, this is it. It's good kind of almost don't want to stuff a lot in my mouth just so I can eat these. Mm. But I love y'all. I love my Bell family. So you know what that means? Ooh, that was a little bit much on one side. So that means I'm gonna stuff these in my mouth. I don't know how many I can fit in my mouth. Cause they're kind of, they're not big, but I mean, after a while, they got a hole in it. Maybe that'll help me put more. Should we count? Can we count to see how much I can handle? I don't even have anything to, no, just a little, little, little knack and count. I just went, ugh. You don't wanna see it, I'm sorry. Let's count. Ready? One. Wait, I should too, I didn't shove it, right? I shove it, okay. Two. Mm. What is this, something done?
Actually, I have some wonderful Dr. Pepper, not a sponsor. What the hell get that sour? Sour, sour. Okay, sour. And oh, have you had your Dr. Pepper today? Cause I'm having another one. Oh, Whew. like it's not bad if you have like a couple or one at a time. Ooh, it depends on, sometimes they put a little extra, but oh my God. Maybe just taking 10 in your mouth isn't ideal, maybe. Ah, just a little bit. Ugh. I'm good now, I'm good now. Ooh. Oh, 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 it's sticky. It's gone, what do you expect, right? Let me know if you did this. Let me know if you did this. How many, if you found these, how many of these sour, they've fallen everywhere. How much of these sour, bright, knockout, heart, very berries did you fit in your mouth? If you did this, I'm dropping everything everywhere. I don't know if y'all want to see the aftermath. Do y'all want to see the aftermath? Do you want to see the nasty though? I don't think you want to see this nasty though. Because it's all slobber. Hopefully there's no slobber on me. Don't get any slobber on me. <laughs> um, let me, ooh, that was a little, I think I had some stuck in my gums. <laughs> Let me know. Smack this like button. I did this for you. I don't even like sour stuff. It tastes good by itself slowly, but when you stick it in your mouth, that's just not a wise decision. <sighs> Thank goodness for Dr. Pepper, am I right? <sighs> oh my goodness. Thank you so much for watching. Smack that like button, show who's boss. Let me know what you thought of this video or just leave a nice encouraging video. I'll see you in the next video.